cycles is slow and your render takes 24 hours to get one second of footage. And we're going to fix that right now. First of all, select GPU instead of CPU because it's faster. Enable the correct GPU under Edit, Preferences, System and select whatever GPU you have. I've only found CPU to be faster sometimes when rendering simulations, but also when Blender crashes while using GPU. The final tip later in this video will show you the most powerful way to speed up your renders, but first let's look at light paths. Light paths calculate light. I personally keep this at a default almost always, but if you have time to play around with these settings for your render, things might speed up. You can either decrease the total right over here, or remove whatever you don't use. No transparency? Get rid of it. Now for the final speed tip that defeats all others. Noise threshold. This one saves you the most time by a long margin. Increase the noise threshold and Blender won't do calculations for all the samples. It will say, you know what? This image is pretty good. So let's go on to the next one. Instead of wasting hours of samples we don't need. I always start at point one, but I might decrease or increase it depending on my render time and quality. One thing you should know, noise threshold works better in bright environments. If it's dark, you get more noise and thus a lower noise threshold will work better. Now finally, here are three more tips that you can use to increase your render speed. Use Alt-D to instance high poly count objects. This will not increase the geometry in the scene, but use data from the original object stored in memory. Number two, before you press render, set your viewport to solid view, because rendered view costs computer power. Number three, compiling shaders and BVH costs a lot of time. Instead of doing it for each frame in an animation, go over to performance and select persistent data. This will decrease your render time. And if you want to know more about product animations, I highly recommend watching this free course next.